Hi everyone, I'm Janet McCabe. I'm the Deputy Administrator at the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency. And I'm here to make sure that you know that this week is National Lead Poisoning Prevention Week. Lead poisoning is a serious issue that affects the youngest children and babies before they're even born. And it can have effects that last their whole life. Lead poisoning comes from a lot of sources that we know about. It can be in the water. It can be in the paint in, in older homes. It can be in the soil. It can come in air emissions from industry. We know what the sources of lead poisoning are in this country, and we know how to fix them. So here at EPA, this week, we're announcing a new strategy, an all of agency strategy to focus on those sources of lead poisoning and lead exposure in our communities and do what we can to make sure to limit those exposures. You know, one thing you may not know is that lead poisoning affects children who are poor, children who are black and brown more than other children. And we have a special responsibility to make sure that they're protected. One of the things that we're doing that's very exciting is with money from the bipartisan infrastructure law, we're working to help communities replace lead service lines in their drinking water systems. Because we don't think that any child, any family in this country should be exposed to lead in their drinking water. So we hope that you will take this opportunity to learn about lead poisoning, to learn about the things that you can do to reduce lead risk exposure for your family one of the most important things you can do is to have your young children tested for lead in their blood. So let's do everything we can to make sure that our littlest kids are protected from this serious environmental health threat. Thanks, everybody.